Two years later, Nick Ayin joined the Fitz Vanderpool Boxing Academy, and through his love for boxing, the 16-year-old has come a long way from his humble beginnings. Well, when I first came here, I didn't know anybody, I didn't know anything. And when I went to school, I, didn't, I couldn't even speak English. I didn't know what, how old he was. Like many immigrants, Kusha Nick Ayin came to Canada with very little. Nick Ayin, though, was determined to make the most of his new lease on life. I wanted to be something. I wanted to make something out of myself and make my parents proud because they brought me here to be somebody. And that's exactly what the 16-year-old is doing. Nick Ayin maintains high marks at Eastwood Collegiate. And through boxing, the once shy 14-year-old has developed into a confident young man who has set the goal of one day becoming a heavyweight champion. Anything you want, you can do it if you work hard at it and do it. But back home in my country, even if you work, work hard at something, you might still have not the chance. But over here, you definitely will have a chance if you work hard at it. Recently, Nick Ayin won the biggest fight of his young career. With his parents by his side, Nick Ayin captured the Tri-City Boxing Championship. When I won, they were pretty happy about it, yeah. My mom was pretty happy, my dad was pretty happy. It's one of those stories that, you know, you see the kid who comes in who has nothing, who, you know, gets to the top and he wins it all and he gets his parents, you know, the things that they want, you know. I think it's a great story. I didn't have much opportunity back at home, so I'm definitely doing better over here and I hope my parents are proud of me. And in the end, a long belief on boxing as I was growing up that it was just all about hitting, but I...